Behind the lines in three, two, one, go. We start off the game just like usual in Autonomous. Game pieces scored during this time get an additional one point above their tally at 42-72, making an impressive toss of their game cargo into the second part of the hub. 829 doing the same. Each alliance ending with one robot on their charge station, allowing them both to be available for that extra ranking point for charge station bonus. The scores are pretty tight, but plenty of wiggle room that will occur throughout the match. 829 already demonstrating how great it is at cycling, moving quickly across from their loading zone into their community. 829 placing the cone now onto the upper, along with three of the Red Alliance partners. Blue is quickly cycling as well. 829 with their unique arched design, quickly tossing into the upper hub for five points and making their way back over to the loading zone. Remember, the loading zone can only be used by that team's robot color throughout the teleop period. 829 still returning, along with its partner 1646 Precision Guestworks, making their way over the charge station. Again, they can continue to do that throughout the match. It's usually a lot quicker to go over, but you're doing a lot more damage on your robot if you're not taking it carefully. 42-72 showing off their swerve drive and how nimble they can move and react to obstacles, making use of their human player at the loading dock to pick up their cones. 10-18 picking up a cube from the other side of the field and delivering it to their grid. They're trying to create as many links as possible. We have reached that cooperation bonus, lowering the threshold for the rank point. They now only need four links instead of five. The score is currently 104 to 86, with just under 40 seconds remaining in the match. The Blue Alliance has successfully completed their threshold for the ranking point. We're keeping a watchful eye as this match comes to the close as they start making way to their way to their charge stations. The Red Alliance is a little short at the moment. They're placing their final game pieces and then they're gonna hop up on their charge station trying to make sure that they stay on top of things as the timer comes to a close. We'll count them down. Three, two, one. And that's the end of qualification match 42. Let's see our scores for qualification match 42. And the winner is your Blue Alliance. With a score 142 to Red Alliance 125, both high scoring in the grid, but that charge station is what caused the difference here. Blue Alliance is keeping their ranking points up to four, keeping their average high.